hundreds of thousands of years, owls have been our friends. But now there's a new disease coming out where owls are the prime contributor. Noctua. I'm Dr. Heselberg, a renowned ornithologist, and today I will be talking to you about Noctua. Noctua is a deadly disease passed from owls to human through direct contact. Symptoms of this include death, delirium, hallucinations, wild fevers, and hunger. We're here with Phoebe Constraint, one of the vi latest victims of Noctua. So, Phoebe, how is life like living with this horrible disease? Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god, there's a war raging in my head! I can't stop it! It's the pirates versus the nymphs! And they can't, they're battling for Treasure Island! It's complicated! There's plotting! There's fighting! It's tearing them apart! It's ridding me of what little sanity I had left! I despise everything! I can't look a thing in the eye! And yet all I want more than anything is to eat! I haven't eaten in months! I'll die! Evie, calm down. You, the last time you've eaten is ten minutes ago. Ten minutes ago? What even is ten minutes ago? What's time in this warped reality? Anna? Can Who are you talking to? Uh, I'm talking to you. I'm Harry Potter. No, you're no. Miss Anna Bukanovic. No. Eight years old. No. Yes, Anna. No. Okay, can no. I ask you something? That's stupid. Can I ask you something? What? What do you think about the owls? Oh, I love them. They're so nice, and they take your letters and your mail, and they kind of just deliver everything for you. Oh. Well, do you think you're getting well adjusted to Hogwarts life? Yeah, I love it. I'm in Hufflepuff. No, wait, yeah. Hufflepuff. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Even though they're taking away all the owls from Hogwarts? No, those people are just stupid. They just think they're Voldemort support. Are you sure, Anna? The owls are getting you sick. No, they're not. They're the best people ever. Anna, are owls people? No, they're animals. Are they your friends? Mm hmm Okay. They're my best friends. See, All I right. I have a pet named Hedwig. Are you sure? Mm hmm Sh Maybe you should be careful around the owls, Anna. No, he's flying. Mwah. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's disgusting. No. All right, all right, Anna. We're just going to say goodbye, okay, Anna? Bye. Today we're speaking with Rainbow Evergreen, an advocate for owls. So Rainbow, what is your line of work? Well, I work with the rescue program and every day I try to rescue as many owls as I can and bring them home and I care for them personally. What do you like so much about owls? What do I not like about owls? They are harmless and they're adorable. Are you concerned that owls are now a danger because of the disease Noctua? Of course not. They are innocent creatures, I tell you. Thank you. All right, thank you, Rainbow. Hello, Edwidge. Ah! So, Rainbow, we're joining you here now outside your home for a follow-up. Uh, what do no! Kill all owls! Ah! We're very intent on finding a cure. Right now, we're looking into turning the feathers blue because white owls are just pure disgust. And while blue owls, are much more fabulous in color, and we believe that the disease only spreads through ugly animals. And by turning the owls blue, we can reverse the disease. And so, sir, what's your take on the Noctua disease? It's Russia! No, it's aliens! No, it's Russia! 